if they're the best team in Europe, can finally be decided in Istanbul. The domination of England is well established. The desperation is to win the Champions League. One final has already been lost. Two years on, Inter Milan stand in their way. We're Man City, we do what we want, we do it our way, we do it the hard way, we've had the tough times. This is our time now. I'm telling you now, this is our time. Haaland's on a different level. Different level to every, any other player. He's like a beast. It is to shut United up, like the fans. You go into work and they're like, oh yeah, United, you'll never do what we've done, but we're getting there, like, it's a new world. Manchester United set the benchmark with their treble in 1999. The noisy neighbours can match that on Saturday night at the Ataturk Stadium. To achieve things, always you have to have the, you know, the correct portion of obsession, you know, to desire, to want it. When the obsession is a, is a positive word for the fact that we desire and are willing, you know, to try to do it. But of course, a dream for all of us. Already they've won the FA Cup by beating United last weekend. This is about how a state and its sovereign wealth can be used to transform a club and gain a soft power tool. There's a trophy and some geopolitical influence to be won here. With owner Sheikh Mansour, the vice president of the UAE and their representative at the King's coronation. Abu Dhabi has provided the financial muscle that's led to investigations into how legitimately the squad has been financed. But critics are just seen as envious of all the success. Success that's just missing the Champions League. Rob Harris, Sky News, Istanbul.